Let's get into uh, cornerback, shall we? Let's deep dive into cornerback. The cream of the crop you've got at cornerback right now is Hobbs coming back. And he did not have the stellar sophomore season that we kind of hoped he was going to have. Um, he, he, was a, he was a beast in that first year and looked to be one of the upcoming stars on the defensive side of the ball. But just didn't have, didn't have the sophomore effort that uh, I, I think we hoped he would have had. And I, and I think that's fair. I think he would say the same for himself as well. Solid, talented guy, and I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing what he can do coming back 100% healthy and, and a, whole, a whole new season. But the other guys who were supposed to be up at the front, along with him, Rocky Asin, restri- unrestricted free agent, and uh, Anthony Averett, an unrestricted free agent as well, both banged up, missed a lot of time. Averett missed more than Rock, um, but both missed a lot of time. Rock, when he was in there, was a uh, playing some some half ass decent corner at times. If I was going to be interested in bringing one of those two back, I would definitely say uh, Rock would be the guy. But I, I don't. I'm not interested in seeing Averett back. Um, those guys are at the top of your depth chart right there. When you're looking at uh, your left, right, and your nickel corners, you're looking at Hobbs, Rocky Sin, and Averett. Uh, behind them, you got a Meek Robertson, and I just don't know if I need to see any more out of Meek Robertson. Honestly, uh, I've not been impressed. He's had some flash plays here and there, but uh, as a whole, I could probably move on from him as well. Uh, but he is under contract, so you may see him back in the fold again this year. He is uh, he is one of the guys you got under contract. Uh, Sam Webb and Tyler Hall also both still under ink. Uh, Tyler Hall had some flashes, and I don't know, man. Webb, I seen Webb on the on the bad end a lot more than I did on the good end of plays last season. Um, if I had to pick between one of those two, I'd go with Hall. But those three guys that I just mentioned, Robertson, uh, Webb, and Hall, they're all under contract. It's uh, Yasin and Averett who are not. They're restricted free agents. So uh, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, behind those guys, you've got um, you've got what uh, Jones, Sidney Jones, the fourth. The fourth back there, and I think you've got uh, Cosby down there who was on the reserves. He's on, uh, he's on your futures. You've got to do something at corner. So that's what I'm saying. I to really think they need to look these first two rounds very, very hard and decide. I think they go interior defensive line, um, you know, go, go Carter, the big guy from Georgia, you know. Or go linebacker, then follow it up with a defensive tackle, vice versa. I think it should be linebacker, defensive line. I think corner is something you can go address through free agency. There are definitely some free agent corners out there to be had. Um, Marcus Peters, Bradley Roby, and uh, James Bradbury are kind of the at the top of the list.